Okay, today I'm showing you guys my three favorite ways of setting up a red wire combination lock. I'll be showing you one one that is original and two with mods. First one is the original. As you can see, it's a pretty big setup and it covers a lot of the map. A lot of the general area, I should say. But have a nice little reset button here. Uh, button open the door from right here. That part is. It's very hard to open from a distance. Okay, next one I'm going to show you was with a mod called Little Blocks. And as you can see, it's very hard to hit these buttons. But, has a pretty nice setup. Very small and compatible. If I put a whole bunch of little blocks around, I can cover up this whole little area and make it completely hidden. Way up, it has a nice little path to it. Easy to control. Easy to set up. Now, if you want to be able to do this pretty easily, I did it without, but you can download the zombie fly mod and that'll allow you to zoom in like you're a little character and make it like so it's normal. But it's a very compatible space, very small, and on multiplayer, this will come in very handy. Alright, the last one I'm here to show you is one of my very favorite ones, and this one's with a mod called Wireless Redstone. As you can see, easy and quick setup. Very easy. Now the downfall is you still need to have this the setup for the combination. But it's very well hidden. You go underground to make it. And it's very, very easily. And I can easily add like a few more buttons down here to control all this. So instead of having a three combination, I can have you like a six or maybe even a seven combination lock. So that is how my three favorite ways to stand up redstone. And thank you for watching.